Ever had your seat belt not retract all the way? Well, this vehicle is 15 years old and it doesn't retract all the way all the time. And one of the channels I follow on YouTube, I did a video so I cannot take any credit for this. It's his idea, but I'm going to give it a whirl and see if it works. Um, sometimes when my seat belt doesn't retract all the way, uh, this part down here gets stuck in the door. Um, I'm not sure if it's actually you saying like the oils on your hand and stuff cause it from retracting. Um, it's probably due to that and you can see right there. Oops. Can't do this two-handed. <laughs> uh, there's some gunk up in there so I'm going to clean that out. Uh, so I'll take you through the steps and we'll see if this works. Got a little helper here. Okay, pull that all the way. Keep pulling. Keep pulling. Okay, is it all the way? Okay, good. I'm gonna clamp this. Okay, you can let go. All right, wonderful. Thank you. All righty. The next step he said was submerge the seat belt in the water for about 15 minutes or so. Just gonna let it soak. I've got some. Uh, laundry detergent and a little palm olive in there as well. Alright, it's been about 15 minutes. Looks like it took some of it off. Let's wipe it down. Yeah, it's getting some more off. So I'm gonna wipe this down. I'm gonna empty out the bucket and do another bucket and just uh, with just plain water just to rinse out the soap so I don't have any soap residue in there maybe attracting more dirt okay well I rinsed it off looks better than what it originally was there is a little staining there and that's probably from the oils and I probably won't be able to get that taken care of but I'm thinking the real reason why this wasn't retracting was the gunk that was up in here was causing too much friction so I'm gonna let this dry and then I'll do a couple runs of it and show you how well it does well it doesn't take long for this thing to dry let's give it a whirl it's still slow sorry about that but it is retracting the whole way, which it wasn't doing before, so I would say this was a successful tip. Thank you very much, Chris, for the idea.